one-handed operation. <laughs> it's Saturday today and uh, I was planning on going up early today as well. That didn't happen. It's gonna be family day and family time. And uh Oh! I got my <laughs> Man. We're gonna buy a sulky for Alexander. I don't do you call it sulky in English? We just say it in Swedish. Sulki. We wanted to have like a stroller that was sturdy and that would last us for possibly a second kid and uh, that didn't break upon us because, you know, it's, it's gonna last to be thrown into the cars and stuff like that. This color is called Black Shadow. We went for this one. This one. Hi, bro. Hello. I think I buy clothes approximately once every year or every other year. I'm very bad at buying new clothes because I use the ones that I have for a very long time. Today is the day. Hmm? This feels a like, lot like my style. Prova. Denik! Denik! Kola, do it, Batman. Trying to avoid the toy store whenever you go out shopping with Alexander. Ever since the pandemic started, we've had very few restrictions in place here in Sweden. There's been no like requirement to uh, use mouth guards. It's only been a recommendations. Recommendations. It's only been a recommendation. And uh, there's also been almost nothing that has prevented us from going to shopping malls or similar stuff because they've been open all the time. So life has kind of been the same here in Sweden as was pre-pandemic with the exception of all the stores has like uh, hand sanitizers and there's like the government has said please do not do this but we have of course like tried to stay our best away from people as possible and I mean like looking at myself the only work that I do requires me and Edwin to be in the same room and that's basically it so for those of you wondering like Sweden is doing fine I will however get my vaccination as soon as it is available but Sweden is very very <laughs> behind on the vaccination <laughs> Might, might not work. I'm probably always going to be amazed by people's incapability of reading signs when it comes to flatting these boxes. Seriously, come on. Now, it feels a lot better and there's way more room to throw away some more cartons. Well, that's a problem. Everything that has to do with sewer in one way or another, another <laughs> is not something that I like to do. Since we're living in a rental apartment and not our actual like own apartment, we can either call the landlord or I can do it myself and then we're gonna have it done quickly. Ah. 
clean the sewer is something that I should do like once every six months, but I always forget it because I think it's so disgusting. Alex was super eager to fly the drone and picked up the controller out of my camera bag and took the drone with him. And as we got out and I started it up. It was not his thing. It was probably funnier running around with it rather than rather than actual flying it. Promise you though, when he's getting older, <laughs> it's gonna be fun.